Let's use similar triangles to measure indirectly. Let's um, think about a flagpole and how it might cast a shadow that's 50 feet long. And at the same time of the day, it's very important, it's the same time of the day, that would be because the sun is gonna make the shadow and we need it to be the same length of shadow. There's a woman standing nearby who is five feet, four inches tall, and she cast a shadow that's 40 inches long. Okay, so let's say that's perpendicular and this is perpendicular. Let's turn the five feet and four inches into inches. We know there's 12 inches in a foot, so five times 12 would be 60, and then we have the four inches, so that's gonna be 64 inches. We will use 64 inches right here for her height. Okay, so let us set up a proportion and cross multiply. And the proportion could be set up in, in many different ways. Um, for instance, you can take this X feet, the height of the um, flagpole, and it corresponds with the 64 inches, and you could put that on the bottom. So I've got the flagpole over the inches, and over here, the on the other large figure, we have the 50 foot shadow, which will correspond with this 40 inch shadow. All right, so 40 times X is 40X, and 64 times 50, let's see, 64 times 50 is 3,200. Then we divide both sides by 40, and X equals, four going to 320, I believe 80 times. So 80 feet tall. This flagpole right here is 80 feet tall, found indirectly.